<sighs> God damn it, it's so cold today. It's raining outside and that's why I have this big jacket on. Anyway, today I want to talk about one of the most practical books I've ever read. And the book is Influence by Robert, is it Robert Sai Saidin Sai Dilin something like that Robert Sai Dilin yeah it, it's a psychology book it's the most practical book I've ever read because I've been able to actually apply some of the things or most of the things in the book and they actually work it's a psychology book. It, it teaches you how to influence people and also be aware of and makes you aware of being influenced when people are trying to influence you into doing something that you don't want to do. It's a great book. It's also about 300, 300 plus more or less uh, pages. It's a soft read. Anyone can understand it. It's, it, it has like practical examples where people tactics it talks about tactics where people use stores use sales people use marketers use to to hack into the human psyche and manipulate people into doing stuff i've seen the funny thing about after reading this book the, the, the manipulation tactics that people do were so visible to me. So some of the people, they do those things without even being aware that those are tactics of manipulation to get someone to do what you want. Some of them are just innocent. Some of the things in, in, in little children, when they try to get their way with their parents and they do stuff trying to manipulate the parent and then the parent because they did not they do not know about these tricks and all the stuff most of them fall into the trap of being influenced by their children but if you know the tactics you'll be like ah i see what you're doing that ain't gonna work for instance the other day i went to 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 the shop to buy some jogging techies, running shoes and the, and then this a young beautiful lady came to me she's a salesperson and she was like hi sir can I help you and I was like no I'm just looking and she's what are you looking for and I was like I'm looking for running shoes and then she took me to to the most expensive sneakers or running shoes and she said that way she started me and then the moment she took me there i was like i know what you're doing i know what you're doing but i didn't say it out loud i was saying it in my mind i was like i know what you're doing but anyway i played along and then i was like no way i cannot afford those shoes and then she's what's your budget and then i tell her my budget and then she took me to to the budget to to the sneakers within my budget range and then I, I looked and then I picked I picked some shoes, some running shoes where that I was happy with. And then after that she was like, would you like some socks to go with that? And I was like, I know what you're doing. <laughs> it was so funny being aware of all those tricks. And then she offered me like small range things like, what else did she offer me? Cleaning spray for my sneak, sneak and all that stuff after I bought those shoes. And I was like, no, and then I ended up just laughing at love. I was like, you're really good at this, who taught you? And she was like, no, we got training and all this stuff. And then we just got to talk. And then I told her, no, I see what you're doing, but keep it up, it's good work. <laughs> and then I just bought my, yeah, my, my running shoes and got out of the store. And that was like, oh, when people start doing those stuff, those manipulation stuff, trying to get you to do stuff, alarm bells just go off in my head after reading this book it's a good book for everyone to read so that you can see when people are manipulating you and you can mitigate it it, it teaches you about uh, reciprocity how people manipulate you using reciprocity and 
people also you manipulate you using commitment and consistency because once you commit to something maybe whether verbally or in writing you are more you feel like more inclined to to see through that you you do the thing because it affects your reputation if you do not do it and you feel guilty that you you promised you even wrote it down and now you are unable to see through so yeah and another thing it, it teaches you how people or people who are in authority like doctors lawyers are much more easy it's much more easy for them to influence people because they are people they are people in position authority so if a doctor says take this pill you just take it without asking most people will just take it they'll go to the doctor and say i am sick of one two three and the doctor will say take this thing and then you don't question the doctor what is it going to do is it okay is it safe or what they you just take it because you feel like that person has authority in that field so who are you to question them so it, it teaches you things like that, that you must always question whether it's people in authority or not. But you need to understand that you can easily get manipulated by people who are in authority. For instance, if I make like during COVID, most of the people, because doctors were saying, take vaccines, no one questioned it. Everyone was just being injected with vaccines and all that stuff without questioning. And most of them were, most of the people had severe side effects. And yeah, so the book also goes into that about people in, on, in authority are able to influence other people. So it's a great book. I'm just going to I'm rambling now but yeah and it also goes into if for instance people like you you are more likely to get away with most of the stuff if you if people like you you are more you'll be more capable to to influence people into doing what you want so yeah it, it just dives into a lot of things like small things which you took for granted and you never put much thought into it but once you've read the book these things come be visible they come every time someone tries to do one of the things maybe or do, that are on that you read about in the book and then alarms just go off and they like hey you read about this they're trying to manipulate you anyway without any giving away more than i should about the book just go and read it i'm sure you will enjoy it as i did anyway that's it for today about the book my lessons i learned from the book if you enjoyed these videos please do not hesitate to hit those like button subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications so that you do not miss any videos that I post about generally anything mostly exercises, gym and everything about just my hustle, my journey I'm just, that's what I'm posting about so yeah, the book is Influence yes, by Robert uh, Robert Saladini I don't know his name, whether I'm pronouncing it correctly anyway, that's it for today Peace. I'm out. Until the next video. Booyah. Booyah.